Okay, what's going on YouTube? Uh, tech tip of today. Um, I've got a voltage regulator that's not charging, um, which, or sorry, a voltage regulator that's not allowing charge, the alternator to charge. Um, so I'm gonna show you how you test for that uh, and determine whether it's your uh, alternator or your voltage regulator. Um, it's a, a very simple test. So I'll first show you what I have going on and then we'll get into the test and then what it should look like. So when I come and look at my situation, this is my voltage regulator. I've just attached it here from this uh, mounting plate that it sits on. And you know, mine's kind of obvious because if I look at the terminals, um, they're obviously crusty. Um, and this one has possibly even uh, fried or shorted from the looks of it. Um, certainly if you look at what the new one looks like, Pretty plain to see that that's not really what it should look like. So I'll show you how to uh, to test for voltage regulator. Okay, so to do this test, you're going to grab your multimeter. You're going to set it to DCV, direct current. And you're going to test your battery. Let me get my hand out of the way here. So as you can see there, battery is reading 12.43. See if we can get a better angle on this. Sorry about that. Okay, now we can see it. So as you can see there, battery is reading 12.42. I'll show you the truck once it's running. Um, and we'll see what you want to be seeing is into 13 volts, possibly low 14s is going to tell us that our alternator is charging the battery. So we'll start the truck up and see what we have. So as we can see with the truck running, our battery is not charging. In fact, our voltage is actually going down slightly because our truck is using portions of our battery. Apologies, it's a diesel, it's very loud. So I'll show you what to do to test your voltage regulator. Okay, so you're gonna come in, we're gonna check our multimeter, truck is running, battery is not charging. We're going to connect, we're gonna jump our voltage regulator to see if this is the issue. So from outside to outside, as soon as we jump it, you can see that the multimeter starts to go up. And now we're charging. So we know our voltage regulator is the problem. Okay, so the terminals that you're jumping, of course, I'm, you know, I'm using one of these older voltage regulators uh, that I know exist on, on old Fords. Um, you know, I believe all the way into the, the early 90s. Um, and the terminals I'm jumping on the farthest right side is F for field. And on the farthest left side, it's hard to make out what that says I for ignition. So you want to jump your field and ignition wire um, to see if you can, can bridge the connection. Okay, and the last clip there is just demonstrating that the new voltage regulator is allowing it to charge. Um, so, super easy fix. Hopefully that helps. I know there's a lot of vehicles, uh, especially old Fords that run these. Um, and I was able to find that for 16 bucks. Away we go. Thanks for watching.